hell does he think he wants a transfer for? It's to do with a change he wants to make in his domestic arrangements. I take it you've done your utmost to dissuade him? Appeal to his sense of loyalty and duty? And point out, as well as being mess manager, next to you is the watch's most senior member, and as such is vital to its cohesion and continuity. Yes, sir, I've said all that, but it just don't seem to sink in. He just keeps asking for a Form 10. It's as if it's become like the Holy Grail to him or something. If I were you, I wouldn't let him get a hold of a Form 10. If you put enough obstructions in his way, he'll, he'll probably abandon the notion out of sheer frustration. I don't want to lose any more hands. We've had enough departures over the last few months. Which is exactly why I want you to act up as station commander. But don't panic, Sydney. Just on a temporary basis, just till this new crop of promotions comes through and I can get somebody suitable. After all, we don't want a repeat performance of the trench warfare that happened between you and uh, a previous station commander. But this time, I want to make sure I find a man that has, has a, a complimentary karma. So there we are, John. A decree of the area, Commander. I am about to be cast adrift on the inhospitable and stormy sea of troubles that is our ground, with nothing to keep me company except a maestro and a pager. So, you'll act up as station officer, Malcolm will be sub, and sick note, connect up as leading hand. <coughs>